Uber? Uber? Is there no Uber taxi? Huh? This is not your car. Kais. No, I have no job. Oh, I thought it's a Uber. Yeah, this is Uber car. Uber. Uber car, but you know you know book to taxi. Which number? Oh. Alright guys, so as you can tell, I'm over here at the Creprotect offices outside of London. Red Octobers, Yeezys, Tiffany's, M&M's, BBC's, ice creams, a whole bunch of shoes. Oh yeah, just Air Max, no big deal. These, a mask of Yeezys, and they got it on the back too. Hey, he comes up and he's like that. So the mask is there. So somebody can actually wear it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Halloween's coming up. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Just, no, one? No, just the one pair. One pair? Yeah. One pair. I'm gonna let this video do the huge announcement, but this is what's going on. You guys already know I've had a partnership with Crep, but things are getting a little bit more serious now. It's going to the next level, so here's the big news. Enjoy this video. My name is Kais Omar, I'm from San Francisco, California, and I'm a YouTuber. So a few years ago, Crep Protect actually reached out to me because they wanted to sponsor one of my uh, videos called uh, Sneakerheads Be Like. And ever since then, we've had a great relationship. Um, the product itself is something that is amazing and I wouldn't work with a company unless I really believed in their product. And to me, they are the top of the top, the best of the best in sneaker cleaning. I am really excited and honored to announce that I am an official brand ambassador for Crep Protect and I'm really looking forward to the journey that we create together. Hello. Alright guys, so we're about to film this little promo video. I'm really gonna vlog while we do it too. Just a video of me walking in pretty much the Crep offices right now. Opening shot boys. Damn it, I opened the wrong door. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's cool, yes. Okay. Alright, when you ready, bro? Alright, ready, go. Alright guys, so we're checking out this little display over here. They got like sneaker masks and these new era hats. And as you guys can see, check this one out right here. This one's really dope. You got the Columbia's, all of this stuff right here. Should I like walk out of the scene? Yeah, so if it like... So we're setting up for this shot of me, you know, holding the sneakers and all that stuff. I wish I could show you guys some of these products. I'm really excited about this product because some of my shoes, they smell. So you just open this up, it's called the pill. And then you put this in your shoe and then you choose like, for instance, let me see. And then you choose like, okay. This is level one, so it gives you a little bit of scent. And then this is level two, gives you more scent. And then level three, even more scent. So it's like there's a science behind it. This shit is dope. It's coming soon. There's more stuff too, but I don't know if I could show you guys. Yeah, I'll just make it look like I'm doing a video tutorial. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Even if you're just, even if you're just focusing on that. Man. What's up, fam? What's going on, bro? All right, guys, if you remember SneakerCon Atlanta, my dude was riding. <laughs> his bike around in the Yeezys. You made me, you made me do that, bro. You made me do that. <laughs> no, you were doing that. You you rolled up to me, you're like, look, I got Yeezys on. What were you trying to make me climb later today? The O2 Arena. The O2 Arena. But he's scared though, man. He wants me to climb the O2 Arena to get it so he can film himself riding his bike on the top of the arena. And I, think he's... What, I think what you should do is, you should put a clip in there showing them what the O2 Arena is. 
the helmet because I do a bunch of contests and stuff as well, like world championships and stuff. And this yeah. is the Crepitat one. Nice. My name on the back there and stuff. And yeah. That's sick. Did you get in trouble when you did the one with the cruise shirt? We, oh, there's always something, yeah? Yeah. There's always a situation. So if we do it on the side of like a delivery van or something or like a Royal Mail thing, yeah. the uh, the guy's like, hey, what are you doing? But yeah. like most of these things are owned by the government. Uh -huh. So they actually, the drivers can't actually do anything. Yeah, so yeah. So only, you just do it and leave. We just do it and leave, yes. yeah. And then I'll do a war ride to Fakie on, underneath the Crepitec sign. Okay, I have no idea what that is. So we're at Crepitec, let's, uh, I, think we should, I think we should jump over the Land Rover. Yeah. I think we can do that. That's easy work, right? I don't see why not, bro. Let's go. All right, let's do it. Woo! Let's Thank show you bounce. guys. It's that, London, you it's that London exclusive right here. <laughs> <Look in. laughs> We're about to dunk this M&M 4 into this bucket of water. Sprayed with the crepe spray, so. This is a... I don't know if I'm gonna do a money title, but this is like a $25,000 shoe, by the way, so I've shown it to you guys before. So the hoop thing isn't working, so I have to just dunk it in. <laughs> Alright guys, finally back in my room. It's currently 7 p.m. I got a gift today from Crepertech. Exclusive NMDs only available in Europe, I believe. Super rainbowy, I know, but these are freaking dope. I like them a lot. Today was a success, man. Now you're probably wondering, Kais, what's the difference between what you've already done with CREP and being a global ambassador? Basically, a global ambassador is like, it's not just somebody who spons is sponsored, it's someone who actually is part of the company and is part of the team. You will see a me being a little bit more involved in certain things when it comes to CREP events and things like that. It might be even like they have an idea and they want to pitch it to me or I have an idea and I want to pitch it to them. It's, it's just more of a, it's more of a connection with each other and I, I know a lot of people are probably expecting me to be like Crep Protect available now in every vlog and no that's not the case it's gonna be very very I mean organic because I already use the product it's just gonna have myself a little bit more involved in certain things that they do which means more traveling for myself which is better content for you guys which is a win-win for everybody so I do want to thank the Crep Protect family for you know giving me this opportunity and helping me grow because if you guys have been paying attention before I started my sneaker channel I did the sneakerheads be like and Crep Protect that's where they found me is they found me through those they didn't find me through my sneaker channel so they really gave me an opportunity opportunity before this whole sneaker thing popped off for me so they really believed in my vision and you know gave me a chance to kind of like prove myself over the past year and a half and now I've had the title of being a brand ambassador and um, I'm really happy to work with them and come up with some dope stuff yeah man that pretty much sums up like the whole day and the whole trip so this whole episode was based around me coming out here to visit the crepe protect offices and you know meet everybody as it's part of the company and uh I had a great time. I just want to thank you guys again for um, watching and supporting and subscribing. I don't think you guys realize this, but a lot of my life, the things I do in my life, getting these opportunities, being a brand ambassador for crepe protect is all because you guys support me and you guys watch me and uh, you have helped me build an amazing crew. So thank you guys. Okay, I'm going to eat now. Thank you guys for watching, man.